Welcome to Lake Como, one of the most beautiful and romantic destinations in all of Italy. Nestled in the foothills of the Italian Alps, this stunning lake is a favorite among locals and visitors alike. Offering breathtaking scenery, charming towns, and world-class cuisine. Lake Como is the third largest lake in Italy. Stretching over 56 square miles and surrounded by steep forested hills and snow-capped peaks. Its deep, clear waters have inspired artists, writers, and musicians for centuries. With its mild climate and stunning natural beauty, Lake Como has become a popular vacation spot for people from around the world. The lake is shaped like an inverted Y, with three branches that wind their way through the surrounding hills. The town of Como is located at the southern end of the lake, while the town of Lecco is located at the southeastern end. The most famous town on the lake is undoubtedly Bellagio, located at the intersection of the three branches of the lake. One of the best ways to explore Lake Como is by boat. Ferries regularly ply the waters, stopping at all the major towns around the lake. From the water, you'll be able to see some of the most beautiful sights in the area, including the magnificent villas that line the shore. Many of these villas were built in the 18th and 19th centuries by wealthy families who wanted to escape the hustle and bustle of Milan and other nearby cities. I'm sorry to interrupt. This is Tucker. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I promise to be a very good boy. Now back to the program. In addition to its natural beauty, Lake Como is also known for its delicious cuisine. The lake is famous for its fish that is caught fresh daily in the lake and served in many of the local restaurants. Specialties include risotto with perch, brisaola, which is a specialty type of air-dried beef, and polenta. For those who love the outdoors, Lake Como is a paradise. The surrounding hills are crisscrossed with hiking trails that offer stunning views of the lake and the surrounding mountains. The lake itself is also a popular destination for water sports, including swimming, kayaking, and windsurfing. No visit to Lake Como would be complete without a visit to one of its famous villas. Perhaps the most famous is Villa Carlotta, located in the town of Tremezzo. This magnificent villa was built in the late 17th century and is now open to the public as a museum. Another must-see villa is Villa del Balbianello, located on the western shore of the lake. This villa was built in the 18th century and has been used as a filming location for several movies, including Star Wars, Episode II, and Casino Royale. Inside, you'll find an impressive collection of art and furniture, as well as stunning gardens that are home to more than 500 species of plants. For a first-time visit, I recommend staying in Verena. 
a charming and picturesque village on the eastern shore of Lake Como. With its narrow streets, colorful houses, and stunning views of the lake and surrounding mountains, Verena is a favorite among travelers seeking an authentic Italian experience. It's also not as busy as Bellagio, so you can enjoy a quiet morning on the main square before venturing out each day. Another plus is Verena doesn't have a, a lot of car traffic cutting through the city. Verena is a pedestrian-friendly city with quiet streets and stunning views to welcome you home after a long day exploring all that Lake Como has to offer. The village of Verena is located on a small peninsula that juts out into the lake, offering breathtaking views of the water and the surrounding hills. The heart of the village is its picturesque waterfront lined with colorful houses and small fishing boats. Here, you'll find a number of cafes and restaurants serving up delicious local cuisine, as well as a handful of shops selling handmade crafts and souvenirs. Enjoy an after-dinner stroll with your favorite gelato and take in the beautiful evening air. If you're lucky, swans may stop by and say hello. One of the most iconic sites in Verena is the Church of San Giorgio, which sits atop a hill overlooking the lake. This beautiful church dates back to the 12th century and features a striking bell tower and a number of stunning frescoes. From the church, you can enjoy panoramic views of the lake and the surrounding mountains. Across the street from the church sit a few local shops and cafes where you can soak in your surroundings. Order a delicious Italian espresso and my favorite, fresh croissants stuffed with a creamy, out-of-this-world fresh pistachio filling. Another must-see attraction in Verena is the Villa Monastero, a beautiful villa and botanical garden located just a short walk from the center of the village. The villa dates back to the 12th century and has been owned by several prominent families over the centuries. Today, it is open to the public as a museum and features a number of beautiful rooms filled with artwork and furniture from different eras. The highlight of a visit to Villa Monastero is undoubtedly its stunning gardens, which are home to a wide variety of rare and exotic plants. Across the lake from Verena, and easily accessible by ferry, you'll find Bellagio, a stunning village located at the tip of the peninsula where Lake Como splits into its two southern branches. Often referred to as the Pearl of the Lake, Bellagio is known for its picturesque waterfront, elegant villas, and stunning gardens, making it a popular destination for travelers seeking a luxurious and romantic Italian getaway. The heart of Bellagio is its charming historic center. With its narrow cobblestone streets, colorful buildings, and charming piazzas. Here, you'll find a variety of shops selling everything from handmade jewelry and leather goods to local wines and olive oils. And when it comes to dining, Bellagio does not disappoint. with a wide selection of upscale restaurants serving delicious regional cuisine.
One of the most famous attractions in Bellagio is Villa Melzi, a stunning neoclassical villa and botanical garden located on the lakefront. The villa was built in the early 19th century for Duke Francesco Melzi Darrell, a close friend and advisor to Napoleon Bonaparte. Today, the villa and its gardens are open to the public and offer a breathtaking display of rare and exotic plants, as well as stunning views of the lake and surrounding mountains. Another must-see attraction in Bellagio is the Church of San Giacomo, a beautiful Romanesque church that dates back to the 12th century. The church features a striking bell tower and a number of impressive frescoes and artwork. From the church, you can also enjoy stunning views of the lake and the surrounding hills. For those who love the outdoors, Bellagio offers plenty of opportunities to explore the natural beauty of Lake Como. You can take a leisurely stroll along the lakefront promenade, rent a bike, and explore the winding roads that lead into the surrounding hills or hike up to the top of Monte San Primo for panoramic views of the lake and the Alps. In the evening, Bellagio comes alive with a vibrant nightlife scene. There are several bars and cafes located around the village where you can enjoy a drink or a meal while taking in the stunning views of the lake. And if you're looking for something more upscale, Bellagio boasts a number of luxury hotels and resorts, some of which offer their own restaurants and bars with panoramic views of the lake. Bellagio is a destination that truly embodies the elegance and romance of Lake Como. With its magnificent villas, breathtaking gardens, and picturesque waterfront, it's the perfect place to unwind and experience the best of Italian luxury. In conclusion, Lake Como is a destination that truly has it all. Stunning scenery, charming towns, delicious cuisine, and a rich cultural heritage. Whether you're looking for a romantic getaway, a family vacation, or an outdoor adventure, Lake Como is sure to delight and inspire. So pack your bags, grab your camera, and get ready to discover the magic of this beautiful corner of Italy.